Maybe. Maybe? Mm-hmm. You're special and babies and you are too. We well, hope you'll join us if you're feeling low. If you do, we promise we'll have fun and learn together. We'll have fun and learn together. Hello. Hello. How you doing, Matt? You know... I'm doing good. I got, I got my uh, good head on my shoulders. Good, good. You wanna know how I'm doing? How? Wait. How are you? How are you doing, Steiner? I'm doing okay, man. I just got sunburned, and I used all the muscles in my entire body. Yeah. Because I was stuck out at sea for seven hours last night. Yeah. We Jamaica Bay. Oh, that must have been a lot of fun. It was crazy, my friend. Oh, really? Yeah. We Why went, was it crazy? Because we ran ashore and the boat started breaking. Different parts of the boat started breaking and we couldn't move and the wind wasn't right and the tides were against us. And then we finally made our way back to shore and people were blasting music and we had to carry this giant 300 pound boat uh -huh. onto the van and then we ate Georgian food. Where, where did you make it back on shore? Uh, Plum Beach. Oh, that's uh, in uh, Brooklyn. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice. Uh, that's a nice beach. It's yeah, a man. psychedelic beach. It, they do. It, they have. They, do you see the turtles? No, I didn't see any turtles. There's like a lot of cool sea life you could see at the beach, like the turtles. I guess they're sea turtles. It's just all weird. Yeah, but we should tell people where we are. We're, where are we? We're in Chinatown. We're in Chinatown. On the street, man. On the. On the street. Oh my god. On the street. Oh my god. On the street. 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 Yeah, man. Hey, man. Matthew. What's up? Uh, today is a special day, right? What's uh, what's, what's so special? About Isn't it, it the, the the gala? Some kind of gala? Oh, they're doing um. It's like the ver it's like the underground version of the Met Gala at Union Square. Everybody puts on a weird wacky uh costume. Is is the Met Gala happening today too? The yeah. real Met Gala? Uh no, that happened like a week ago. Okay, so this is just a version of it's like the underground art version of the the gala. I, anyway, for me it's just an opportunity to act weird. Yeah. And just go <laughs> and and you know, I like to act weird and jizz out, you know, like jizz out your heart. Like, <laughs> you know, I get a heart on it. Any opportunity to act weird. Any opportunity to act weird and give love like wacky love. Yeah, man. You know, you know, that's why we connected. We connected at a wacky love level. I agree. Wacky I, love level. Wacky love level. Oh! oh. 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 Matthew, so I got some uh, I got some lessons of knowledge from the wisdoms of creativity, uh, and our elders of of super uh, imagination and and construction. Well, this is stuff I like to hear. Uh, so yeah, for 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 people who don't know, we we initially didn't know what we were going to call this podcast. Yeah. And last time we realized we both were in special ed. Right. And we decided why not go with that special, special ed, ed babies. babies. You know, that's that, why we're different. That's why we're different. Very <laughs> relatable. You know what I mean? A lot of people have been in special ed. It's just like, what what did that mean when you were so young? You didn't know what that meant. You're like, hey, you get to be in the honor class, really smart people. Yeah. And you go into special ed and you you just stay with the normals. What is that? What does that mean? Yeah, you know exactly. I mean? It's like when you're young, you don't even know who you are. You don't know who you are. What is... But already there's a caste system. Yeah, exactly. Of smartness. It's very confusing. Very confusing. That, does that mean I don't? I'm not uh, authentic, <laughs> authenticated to talk to the smarter people. It yeah. could be that weird system. Like, are the slower people unable to talk to smarter people because smarter people are so smart that we wouldn't even be able to connect anyway? Am I worth less to society? Like that's the thing that I thought. Yes. Am I worth less? Yeah. 
Um, so, but this is a quote from Seymour Papert, who was a educated, renowned educator. Seymour Paper. Okay. Undoubtedly, there are kids with intellectual deficiencies and neurological problems. Right, right, right. But a lot of kids shunted into special education classes are deficient only in a willingness to conform to the school pattern. Yeah. They are just honest, brave kids who say, I just won't take that. And I don't believe in what you're doing. And if you give them an alternative to the usual classroom, they break free of a lot of inhibitions and bad associations and they begin to learn. Right? Did, right. You, did you feel that when your teachers like gave you an opportunity to be yourself without any conditions? Then you started to be like, oh, yeah, learning is fun. Yeah. Yeah, when there's no conditions, you you don't even know you're learning. It's yeah. part of this process of just being. Learning doesn't become a chore, it becomes being. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's just like the way they formulate it, they've made it into a chore, and then it's something you don't want to do. Nobody wants to do something. They have to do to, against, in the way they, the other person wants to do it precisely instead of the way that feels natural. Right. Yeah. When's the last time you learned something? When's the last time I learned something? Good question. I don't know. I feel like I'm always learning. I'm learning how to dance right now. What? I'm learning how to dance right now. That's what I'm saying. It's just like every time we dance, you learn in different ways you can move your body. Like yeah. this is like years and years of experience. Right <laughs> yeah, now. man. We're just... We're like, <laughs> this, is, this doesn't come from nowhere, man. Yeah, dude. We, we studied to get this. I'm a this professional dancer. Yeah, exactly. My mom was a kind of semi-pro dancer. Oh, okay. She did like children's ballet. Children's ballet. <laughs> you know what? The last thing I learned how to do was like... Um, I learned yesterday how to how to use a sail correctly sail? in the wind. Uh huh. Like, yeah. So that was a lot of hard work. Yeah, but like you, it's all about balance, man. You got to balance the waves against the direction of the wind, against the shape of the sail. You right. Got, you got to make the sail a different shape depending on the direction. Right, 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 right. But it's all about balance, it's man. It's a balance. Balancing factors. You know. Like we're balancing each other's movements, but we also got to balance the camera and we also got to not, not interrupt people who are walking past us too much. Right. So we're, it's all about balance. Yes. We're all kind of like always at a place where we can learn balance. And this brings us to our, my next thing that I plan, martial arts. Martial arts. Because we were doing a kind of Qigong thing. Have you ever done push hands? What's push hands? push hams you push the ham in the shopping cart to the register and then you check out that's push hams but push hands is wow. where you do tai chi and you try <laughs> to get you go like this you move circles like this and then you try to push the other person off balance with while maintaining your own balance without getting off balance yourself oh, okay that's push hands <sighs> Did that, did that work? Did yeah, that you did it good, man. No, you're, you're a natural Tai Chi master. You made it easy for me. No, I didn't really. Um, but I want to do, like, what would you, if you had a martial arts, let's come up with a scenario. Yeah. Where, let's say you have to defend yourself. Okay. And come up with a very specific type of defense for that scenario. Okay. So let's say I am a storm hunter i hunt tornadoes and i see you walking down the street and you're spinning and there's a lot of dust and i think you're a tornado and i'm trying to capture you in a in a metal container okay okay you ready yeah all right wait you guys wait you can't go that far away okay sorry one two three <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. 
I think you didn't really stop me. You kind of just let... Wait, we got to get back in camera. Uh. <laughs> you got to just let me... I think we're good. We're good. Okay. All right. You just dizzy. You dizzy, buddy. You okay? <sighs> All right. You help. You try to... <sighs> you okay. Will you come with a scenario what, for me to uh. defend myself? You want, a, you want a scenario? Yeah. All right. All right. You need, some, you need a sip of water? You oh, need yeah. to rehydrate after... Yes. Being a tornado is thirsty work. If you are a tornado, drink co drink coconut water. <laughs> it will replenish all your electrolytes that you lost by destroying people's houses and cows. <laughs> okay, so um, you're a zebra. Okay. And you're coming on the frame uh -huh. in zigzag formation. Okay. And because you the only way you know how to move is because of zig zigzag. Um, <laughs> like some I, stripes? I, I, what I do is I... Hey, don't turn your back. What? Your face I know what I'm doing. Shit. <laughs> I flatten you out. I flatten out your zigzag. So I straighten you out. No, this is not... I put you in a straight path. And you're zigzagging. Come up with a... Come up with a situation. That was a scenario. But I'm not a zebra. Um, you just come up with a situation like where I would, me as Andrew Steiner, I would actually be in a potential in that situation. Like that might really happen. And well, you, I was a tornado last you time. You were just spinning like a tornado. Oh. And I was a weird guy who thought you were a tornado. Yeah. You can be weird. You can be like not a normal thing. Okay. But I want to be like a, a human being at least. Okay. So, um, you come on as um, you come on as a human being, and you have <laughs> you you have a penis problem. So I'm a baby being born, and you're a doctor trying to circumcise me. Okay, so okay, so then I become a doctor, and I circumcise and you. I'm trying to defend myself as a just as, as a just, baby, just being born, but not just any baby, a special ed baby. Okay, sounds good. So right. you'll be a special ed baby. Kick, 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 are, we, kick. are we doing it now? Yeah. Okay. Kick, 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 kick. I'm coming out feet first. Coming out feet first. Coming out feet first. Not, coming not out the feet rabbi. First. Not my pee pee. You not touch my rabbi pee pee. Rabbi snip snip. <laughs> Let rabbi snip. Let no. the rabbi snip no. snip. No. Snip it. No. <laughs> Snippy tip no. with the rabbi. Ah. Oh, you got me once. I tai chi you. But can you tai chi me too? Mom! Dad! <laughs> Alright, I don't have the energy for another one. <laughs> Dad! Can you tai chi me too? <laughs> Mom! Dad! Help me! This Just... guy is no! He's trying to take my pee pee off, man. What are you doing? Dude? I know. I just got here. Hey, man. We're, we're cool, man. I, I just got born, and you're trying to take my pee pee off, Doc? Look, man, doing, I was just dude? following the script, man. I'm, we come here. We don't. We never ready. You just got to follow the script. You're never ready. Yeah. So just follow the script, man. Yeah, I agree. We're never ready for this yeah. shit. Dance break. Someone was my my lobby in my building. People always leave stuff for people to take, and someone left this hat. And then the first time I saw it's it, a nice hat. Yeah, I wasn't gonna take it because I'm like, someone wore this hat. But then yeah. I saw it again, and I'm like, this is a great color. <gasps> great color. I like yeah, this hat. It's not one color. Yeah. Very unique. Oh, it looks good on you. Thank you, Matthew. You're welcome. Um. Okay, I got another thing. You got another thing. Yeah. Um, biology, bro. You know about biology? What do you know about biology? Um, okay. Biologically, yeah. women's bodies, they, they usually they have this need to have a baby. Yeah, I'm fixing it. And bike. biologically, men, sometimes they have the need to have like a child. This is mm -hmm. like this extension like legacy is almost like biologically inbred. People have this need that we must live on. <laughs> but that's never the case. You don't live on. You just, Your we're all dead. living on. It's just, 
we live on. You're already living My on. My heart will go on. Far Avida. <laughs> she never cried for me. She ate my mom. She loved my dad. But she was a sinner. And she loved us. She zapped us with electricity. <laughs> and made us dance. She had like she there was a girl in the party. She looked like a Bacardi bottle. I saw her, she smelled like rum. Smelled like rum. I asked her if I could put ice on her and if she let me sip on her. And she said, the duh, duh, of course. What are you, duh, 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 dumb. Dumb, dumb. And I said, no, I'm not dumb. No, I'm just I'm really, really thirsty. And she said, okay, that's cool. I'm sorry for calling you that. And I took a sip and it was so damn good and i said can i have another and she said i thought you would never ask 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 look at my ass i said ask ask ass say look at my ass oh. <laughs> okay but the biology quote yeah biology that's what we were talking about Oh, we're talking about biology? Yeah, do you remember that? Oh, yeah, wait. Where are, wait a minute. We're talking about biology? Yeah, how's your mic doing? Oh, yeah. Um, it says, overall, the future will be mostly for the better. And if it is not, the reason will be due to choices, political choices for how we govern, govern society, choices how we attend to the needs of our populations and societies. I guess that's not really biology. That's polit politics. I don't know why I wrote po biology. Um, but yeah, that's a political thing. So you think the, the only thing stopping a better future is how we govern society and how we listen to the needs of the people? Yes, we, we actually got to listen to the needs of the people because then we learn that the people are us we're actually fulfilling something that's spiritually divine. Mm. But because uh, it's disconnected, it's not about the needs of the people. Yeah. We're, at the end of this, we find that this system was actually not at the needs of anybody. Mm. We're at the very end of this, we find, because at the very end of this, this is just going to dis be destroyed. So that's how we're going to find out. It was at the needs of no one. It was just an unconscious <laughs> disease of ego uh, imagination gone over over the top. It's like a game that went bad. Yeah, I feel like some po politicians are really trying to do things for the people and address the needs. Well, yes. And then others are just trying to make as much money as they can as soon as possible, you know? Yes, but it's... Um, it's a lot. It's been a long process. Yeah. So I, I don't know. This is at the. We're at a renaissance where a lot of great things are happening, but we're also at this tipping point where a lot of the um, terrible things might happen. Like but what? It, it's like always, what? Like what? Matthew? But the joke is, it's always been like that. Yeah. I don't know the future. You yeah. know what I mean? So who am I to say that? I'm sorry. Let's pretend we're... Please, I'm not a soothsayer. Let's pretend we are, I'm just an though. idiot. Let's oh. pretend we are. Pretend we are soothsayers? Soothsayers, yeah. I'm going to see a vision, channel a vision. I see on the date of March 16th, 2047, a man with bright orange underwear will descend from the sky. He is 36 feet and two inches tall, and his butthole smells like vinegar chips. And he comes down in the center of Minneapolis, Minnesota, and he says to the people, I like tiramisu. Make me a me-sized tiramisu. And the people congregate and make a giant dessert Italian-style mascarpone fingers, cocoa dust and espresso, and he eats it, and then he reascends into the sky. Notice, 
Put this in your calendars and you will see it happen and come to pass. That, that's my prediction. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Do you have a prediction? Oh, prediction? You want me to have a prediction? When you just told me that? Yeah. Okay! Maybe. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Scissors. Maybe scissors will come right at me. Just me. Nothing one else. I'm the only one who gets this in my nose. Ah, yeah, okay. Look at that. Look at that. I took it. I took it. Ah. What? That's. I took it. That's not a prediction. I took you're it. Just, you're ah. just putting scissors in my face and to seal my nose. That's an uncle trick. Oops, I got your nose. That's that's just. Give it back. Ow. Shame on you. Ouch. You don't steal Ow. things like that. I got sunburned Fuck yesterday. You. Fuck you. Ow. Give it back. I can't. Get back. No. You asshole. Ow. Who do you think you are? Ah. Go get it. Don't hit me. You don't hit me. This guy comes in. This guy comes over here. Starts hitting me. He steal my nose. I just stole his nose back. And he's like hitting me. What? Is... Hey, man. Why did you hit me? You stole my nose first. I'm in the moment, man. All right? Yeah. What's wrong with being in the moment? Don't judge me. Well, you are you trying to manipulate the whole situation. Could, no, Hitler was just being in the moment. Hitler? Hitler. <laughs> oh. Why why even go there? Where where is Is it is is he here right now? He's Is he here right now? He's Hitler. Is that what this means? No. My height? No, actually. My height? Steal your face does not steal your skin. This is steal your face. That's what they call this symbol. In the, your... in the Grateful Dead ministries of Utah. Steal your face, not your skin. Yeah, this Hitler tried to steal their skin. Uh, but anyway, on to anyway, brighter things. On to better things. Matthew, do you, um, do you have any, like, goals? This Like, summer's coming. It's fast approaching. It feels like you just turned spring. Do you have any goals for this summer? Do I have any goals? Yeah. Yeah, I have to, to build the renaissance. Okay. To, to jump in the renaissance and be part of the light, that what the culture, that's what's going on. Yeah. We all have, as an artist, we all have a part to play and to expand this renaissance that anything is possible with art. Like, you could do anything unimaginable mm. in... A low budget format with just one microphone and anything is attainable. It's sustainable. It's cleanable. It's gleamable. It's Start spreading the, the gossip. gossip. Start, Start spreading the rumors. rumors. Start, Start spreading, spreading all the shitty news. news. All of it. it. So, so people finally get it. that all of this it is a silly <laughs> willy illusion that never it existed. existed. And you, you should have, have more fun today. Well, that's been Special Ed Babies. Thank special you. Ed Babies are here for you. <laughs>
Bye, everyone. Special Ed Bangs are here for you. People, uh, for everyone. Please subscribe, tell your friends, leave a review on iTunes. We're all Special that Ed stuff. Babies uh. because we were in Special Ed at kindergarten. Yeah. That's why we were Special Ed Babies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were Special Ed Babies because we were born into something that we never chose and we accepted because we had no choice but to accept what was put right in front of our faces. And here we are, radically accepting. I am special. I am special. <laughs> educated. <laughs> I I'm special educated. We're especially educating you and you're especially educating us back. So That's right. A label's just a label. We're just silly gillies. And a ladle is for soup. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. When there's a world and you see yourself and it's in the mirror and your reflection is fly, you go with your heart, you turn it on and you jizz out your heart. With jizz out your heart, you gotta jizz out your heart with love on top, with love and joy. You jizz it out in multi colors, and everybody's having fun. So let's all just have some fun in the sun, fun in the sun, fun in the sun. Fun, fun in the sun, sun. yeah, fun yeah. Fun in the sun. I'm gonna juice out I'm your heart. Juice, juice. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. <laughs> that's, that's we right. just keep on jizzing, buddy. It never, it never stops. It just keeps going, buddy. It just never stops. It's not meant to stop. It just keeps on going. And you gotta work with it however you want it. And you know, Whatever happens, we're going to let it happen. We're going to finally say yes. Yes to what's happening because just just letting it happen and then you let it, let it happen. All right, I'm turning off the camera. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. Do you, honey? Just do you, honey. Just, just do you. Yeah. Just, just do you. I said just do you. <laughs> and cut. Special <laughs> you. Well, hope you join.